Welcome to another episode of Black and Blue. And this episode is called uh, Tohu Va Vohu. Tohu Va Vohu. And you're like, what in the world is he even speaking English? I am not speaking English. Am I speaking English? No, you're speaking Hebrew. I'm speaking Hebrew. Oh, <laughs> OT Hebrew. That's right. Yep. Tohu Va Vohu. Yeah, so uh, it was the baptism of our Lord recently. And uh, the OT reading for uh, Series B with the baptism of our Lord is actually Genesis chapter 1, verses 1 through 5. And uh, that got us thinking, like, why is uh, that OT reading paired with the baptism of our Lord? Mm -hmm. And uh, really it comes down to the fact uh, we have a Lord who uh, brings uh, form and fills that form, brings all of that out of, out of nothing, tohu vavohu. Because tohu vavohu actually means without form and void. Mm -hmm. so, uh, so in the very beginning, uh, the Lord uh, using... Spirit, water, and word, and word uh, uh, gives form to that which had no form and fills that which was empty, right? So, tohu va uh, goodbye, right? Uh, the Lord, uh, see, he wants form and he fills mm -hmm. uh, that which he forms because he has perfect form. Mm -hmm. And uh, and he is filled overflowing with, uh, with, with, uh, with what, Deaconess? With. Goodness? Yeah. Oh, I think so. Uh, well, we know that because <laughs> at, the, at the end of six days of uh, forming and filling, the six days of creation, uh, God looks out at the world and he says... It uh, is very good. It is very good. Yeah. This God who is pictured at the very beginning of history mm -hmm. as a mother hen. That is mm -hmm. actually the image yeah. that God uh, gives uh, for himself at the mm -hmm. very beginning. Mm -hmm. A mother hen. It's so easy to miss. Right. Uh, but the spirit is hovering over the waters, right? It's, it's outstretched. Yeah. Uh, the word hovering there, brooding, mm -hmm. uh, it's, it's the image of a mother hen. And, you know, Jesus takes on this image mm -hmm. uh, himself when he weeps over Jerusalem right, right before uh, Holy Week or during Holy Week, I should yeah, say. Yeah. Uh, Jerusalem, Jerusalem, uh, how I would have gathered you as mm -hmm. a mother hen gathers mm -hmm. her chicks, but you would, you would not. not. And this is what our God is doing right at the very beginning, right? The wings outstretch and he's mm -hmm. gathering everything and everyone mm -hmm. underneath those, uh, those, uh, wings of welcome and warmth mm -hmm. protection. Yes. Yeah. Where everyone is to belong. Mm -hmm. yeah. As a home. Yeah. yeah. Except someone didn't want the home. No. <laughs> Who was that? Uh, Adam and Eve. Oh, Mr. Adam and Mrs. Eve, our first parents. <laughs> They uh they rebelled and refused. Yeah. They had no reason to. Mm -hmm. They wanted actually more than one Lord, right? Right. That was the problem. Like Lord Eve, Lord Adam. Yeah. yeah. And just and just and turn all these gifts of God into Lords. Mm -hmm. You know, things that they can fear and love and trust and above all else. What it did, it locked us up, all of humanity, in sin's tyranny. They 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 chose instead of the blessed holy trinity, they chose actually sin's tyranny. Oh. Uh-huh. And uh, what it did, it really made our world so much smaller, mm -hmm. made the world so much smaller. Actually, mm -hmm. each of us has our own little world, and mm -hmm. it's filled with all these lords, and mm -hmm. leaves us tohu va vohu, yep. without form and, and empty. Yeah. And empty, void, yeah. It means, oh, oh. So, uh, <laughs> uh, has anything changed? No. Yeah, I mean, we're conceived and born, actually, uh, in sin's tyranny. Mm-hmm. And, uh, and we come into this world thinking that I got to form my life and fill my life. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. And since tyranny offers all these, uh, these Lords, a buffet, mm -hmm. a smorgasbord mm -hmm. or a smorgasbord. Mm -hmm. I know it's a pretty bad joke. <laughs> Horrible joke. And, 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 and these Lords, we, we, they're, they're pretty common. We, we actually know them. They yeah. have names. Yeah. Explain it, Deaconess. Yeah. I mean, Anything that we're trying to find uh, to give form to our lives. I mean, like the Lord, um, the SAT score, um, the sports accomplishments, the uh, coolest jo summer job, the, um, hmm, what would be another one? The greatest vacation. Oh, the friends. Yeah. I mean, the, the sports. Mm -hmm. and uh, academic accomplishments, mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. you know, the uh, the college, like you know that dream. Yeah, college. the college scholarships. Yeah, that, uh, yeah, too, yeah. <laughs> you kind of need those too. Yeah. Yep. 
Yeah, and we think, you know, if we just get that Lord and this Lord, then my life will be formed and filled. Mm-hmm. What we find is like our life is a, is a bucket with lots of holes in it, though. Uh-huh. It's just, it's so leaky. Uh-huh. And it's all empty. We, we, we can't get no satisfaction. Satisfaction. <laughs> it's never e, 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 enough, 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 enough. You're always on empty. You're always it's a on different empty. E. <laughs> and, but, you know, it, I mean, here's the thing is like, you know, you know, actual life isn't really, uh, you know, the circumstances and situations, mm-hmm. uh, the uh, you know, accomplishments. accomplishments. It's, it's, no, it's not that. I mean, but mm-hmm. since tyranny wants us to think that, you know, real lasting life mm-hmm. is found in, you know, mm-hmm. friends and family, mm-hmm. upward mobility, mm-hmm. um, you know, mm-hmm. accomplishments and the trophy, mm-hmm. you know, the cash we, that we, uh, you know, stashed. Away for a day that's rainy. Oh, you know, I, I keep going. I, I know I'm just you rhyming, can. I'm just rhyming away now. I'm sorry. I can't help my when it starts when the rhyme train starts. It's game over. What else? What else? Are you saying that those lords are basically anything like if I only had blank? Yeah. And these are actually good gifts from from, yes. from our lord. Like we're, yeah. we're gonna poo poo right. friends and scholarships and mm-hmm. trophies, mm-hmm. but you know none of that is actually real lasting life. And we know that yeah. deep down because well. <sighs> Our experiences uh, tell us, you know, all that stuff's passing away. Mm -hmm. It doesn't last. It doesn't last. Mm -hmm. It doesn't last. See, locked up in sin's tyranny actually leaves us tohu vavohu, Mm -hmm. without form. And void. And void. Yeah. Unformed. Unfilled. Unfulfilled. Mm -hmm. Tohu vavohu. Uh, Thankfully, uh, the Lord that brought uh, really, uh, you know, all of this world out of tohu vavohu, Mm -hmm. uh, he kind of does it again, doesn't he? Mm-hmm. Doesn't he? Mm-hmm. And doesn't he use kind of the same ingredients? Same ingredients. Uh, spirit. <laughs> Water. Word. That's right. Yeah. Same ingredients. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> this one who is real lasting life. Yeah. Uh, he, he, he actually, he, he continues doing his, uh, his uh, creation out of nothing job. Mm-hmm. Right. Mm-hmm. At the font. Yep. Especially at the font. Yes. Yeah. Through, uh, uh, spirit, water, word. Mm-hmm. Uh, we are baptized into this uh, this one Lord, mm-hmm. and uh, He forms our lives and He fills our lives mm-hmm. with with goodness, goodness mm-hmm. in and for this world. It's such a load off my chest. I don't yeah. have to form my life and fill it. Mm-hmm. Someone yeah. does that for me. Yeah. So it's not self made. We're not self made. We're savior made. Uh-huh. That's right. Oh man. <laughs> Yeah, we Americans, we think we're all self-made. Pull yourself up by your bootstraps. Yeah, it's a lie. And and see, we can just be honest about that. Yeah. We we don't have to we don't have to like, you know, live life in, in some fantasy. We can just be mm-hmm. real and say, you know, these things can't actually form my life and fill. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Fill f- f- fill it, fill mm-hmm. them, you know? Um and uh and we see actually in uh the gospel reading for this uh, baptism of our Lord, Mark chapter one. We see people doing just that. Yeah. I mean, they're just being honest with themselves. What, mm-hmm. what are they doing here? I'll, I'll just mm-hmm. you want me to read yeah, it. Yeah, please. And all the country of Judea and all Jerusalem were going out to him and were being baptized by him in the river Jordan. That is uh, J. Bap, John the Baptist, mm-hmm. confessing their sins. Confessing their sins. Mm-hmm. What are they doing, deaconess? They're saying, "My Lord is this. It's blank." They're confessing who their lords are. And, all the false lords. And it ain't working. Exactly. They are unformed and unfilled, mm-hmm. unfulfilled. Tohu va bohu. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I mean, they're saying these lords leave me uh, waiting for and wanting so much more. Well, mm-hmm. the more was coming. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The one who is the Lord mm-hmm. on his way. Mm-hmm. And that's why they can just like let their hair down. Just yeah. tell the truth about themselves. And, uh, and the loving, uh, uh, living, liberating Lord does appear. Mm-hmm. Yes, in human flesh to stand in solidarity in the Jordan River with all these people who are confessing their sins, confessing all their little lords. Um, there Jesus is, and he's having all of those um, little lords, false lords, uh, washed onto him in baptism. Yeah, he's going to carry them where? To the cross. To the cross! See, you know, what's really cool about Mark's gospel, I- I'm a big fan. <laughs> yes. Uh, I'm a fan of the whole Bible. Let's, let's be clear. Uh, like the Gospel, gospel of Mark. But, but he uses a verb twice in, 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 in his Gospel mm-hmm. uh, to tear apart. 
at, at the Jordan and then at, at Calvary. Mm -hmm. So in the Jordan, the heavens are torn open. Mm -hmm. And then at Calvary, the temple curtain is, is torn apart. So he connects the baptism of Jesus with the crucifixion of Jesus. He, he wants us to see those two as almost like a single event, basically. Yeah. Um, and, uh, and what's really great is you have this Lord in the Jordan carrying all of our Lords, mm -hmm. uh, you know, to Calvary. And there, you know, the temple curtain is torn from top to bottom. And, and what's, what's on the other side, other side of that, that, that curtain? Mm -hmm. Nothing. It's empty. Holy of Holies, empty. Just like those Lords are empty. Like they're going to yep. leave us empty. Yep. And he crucifies these Lords at, at the cross. He brings them to nothing. Uh, because you know they're they're gonna bring us to nothing if we fear, mm -hmm. love, and trust in them. Mm -hmm. And he bring he brings them down into his death. And he brings not just those lords down into his death. He brings our idolatry, our you know uh, rebellion, high treason, uh, mm -hmm. all the all the ways that we have uh, you know chase after uh, these lords, thinking they're gonna mm -hmm. form our lives and fill them. Mm -hmm. You know, our fearing and loving and trusting in these lords, these false gods, right? Yes. He brings all that down into the black hole of his death so that he can he can actually uh, free us up. Mm -hmm. He So all that locks us up in sin's tyranny, he brings down into his death so that from within he can free us up. Alleluia, Christ is risen. He is, he is risen, risen indeed. indeed. Alleluia. Alleluia. I mean, this is the death, <laughs> the only death where we will find life. Exactly. And that's yeah. actually how it always works. Always, there has to be a death before a resurrection. That's There's right. a going down, a uh, descent before an ascent. Yeah, the only way you can go up yep. is to go down. Go down. Yeah, and uh, and so so much for American <laughs> upward mobility, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, I was just gonna hate this one. Cap we have the Jesus mobility. <laughs> yeah, cap capitalism's not gonna like this video. Oh man. Oh man. And and, and go down, uh, not not just anywhere. Go, but, but but go down into a grave, and not just any grave, but Jesus's grave, the grave of our Lord Jesus. Yeah. And and we can't get there on our own, but that's the gift of baptism. Baptism actually buries us with Jesus, so that mm -hmm. we can rise with Him. Baptism is really uh, the beginning of many beginnings. Yes. Right. Uh, dying and rising with Jesus daily, so that we can be formed and filled. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, with. With his goodness right. and for this world. Mm -hmm. And so then we have him ringing over our, his voice, ringing over our ears. It is very good. You're my beloved son, my beloved daughter, yeah. in whom I'm well pleased. You're so good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we don't earn that either. It's just, no. it, we have it before we can do anything. Right. Uh, you know, it's this, uh, yeah, this whole performance uh, based religion. Yeah, throw yeah. that out. Right. <laughs> Uh, more like proclamation based. Yep. Like uh, our Lord proclaims that, uh, yeah, we're like his beloved and we're, he's, he's most well pleased with us. Exactly. We have form. We're not empty. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And so what's really, really beautiful is that, you know, every day we remember our baptism, die with Jesus, rise mm -hmm. with him. We don't stay just in the grave with him. He takes us by the hand, leaves, leaves us, and he leads us out of that watery tomb mm -hmm. into a whole new life. You know, we walk in newness of life, as Romans 6 talks about. Mm -hmm. uh, so this is the life that reaches beyond the grave. Uh, the life uh, that uh, has no condemnation. Uh, the life that lives under the protective wings of, of uh, you know, this, uh, this Lord of ours. Uh, the, the life that is, uh, is uh, you know, just uh, uh, it, it, uh, brings us together in a corporate life so we don't have to uh, bear the pain and the suffering of this life, you know, all by ourself. Um, it's it's the life that uh, you know is indestructible. Mm -hmm. You know, nothing in this life can actually derail it. You know, I mean, we are death proof. Uh, the life that uh, you know is being formed more and more and filled more and more by and with uh, our Lord's goodness. Mm -hmm. uh, the life that, as Deaconess said before, is not self made, but but savior, savior made. made. Yeah, it's beautiful. <laughs> It is. Yeah. It is very good. It's, it's <laughs> tov ma'ov. Yeah, ma yeah. yeah. Oh, tov? Yeah, tov oh, ma'ov. Oh, you have to explain what that means. That means very good. Yeah. 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 There we, we go. We can't there we have go. just one Hebrew phrase. Yeah, well, 
So, uh, so Tohu va Vohu. No more, really. Yeah. yeah I mean, we're, we're, we're not uh, without form and empty. We have form mm -hmm. and we are filled. Yes. Uh, all with uh, our Lord's goodness. Mm -hmm. um, and so what a joy to know that we don't have to form our lives and fill them. Jesus mm -hmm. does that for us. Mm -hmm. uh, and, you know, what's really great is as we remember our baptism, we're going to discover more and more, you know, uh, uh, where we belong. Yeah. With warts mm -hmm. and all. Mm -hmm. uh, where real lasting life is tasted and enjoyed. Mm -hmm. uh, where uh, true love is found. Mm -hmm. Right, uh, all uh, all from our one Lord, yeah, our one Lord Jesus, yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Um, and you know, one day uh, there won't be many beginnings, just just a beginning, the mm -hmm. beginning, the final one. That'll happen mm -hmm. on the last day mm -hmm. uh, when the J Day trumpet uh, sounds. Mm -hmm. You know that crucified, that nail scarred hand will reach down and bring us off of our graveyard beds into uh, a whole new world, mm -hmm. and we will be. Fully formed and fully filled with uh, with with God's goodness, and so will the world. Mm -hmm. and, and we're going to hear God God speak, our Lord speak those words. It mm -hmm. is very good. very good. And when those words are ringing in our ear mm -hmm. on the last day, we will know that this is the beginning that has no end. Yeah, tohu va vohu. No more. No more. No more. Isn't that great? It is. Until next time. Yeah. Well, yeah. By his stripes. Sorry. There we go. There we go. We are healed. By his stripes. By his wounds. We are healed. There we go. Okay. Until next time. Cheers.